You are walking in the street when somebody stops you and speaks to you. What does he want you to do? A. Give him directions. B. Give him an address. C. Take him somewhere. Excuse me, I wonder if you could give me a hand. I'm looking for the National Central Bank, and I seem to have got a bit lost. I've got this map here that they sent me, and they've marked where it is. But I'm afraid I can't work it out. I keep ending up in the same place. I know it's very near here, so would you mind terribly coming along with me and pointing out the place, as long as it's not out of your way, of course. Excuse me, I wonder if you could give me a hand. I'm looking for the National Central Bank, and I seem to have got a bit lost. I've got this map here that they sent me, and they've marked where it is. But I'm afraid I can't work it out. I keep ending up in the same place. I know it's very near here, so would you mind terribly coming along with me and pointing out the place, as long as it's not out of your way, of course. You hear someone talking on a public telephone. Who is she talking to? A, her employer. B, another employee. C, a doctor. I think I'm going to be in a bit late today. Could you let him know? N no, I can't rearrange it. Look, it's a firm appointment. No, I know he gets annoyed if anyone's late, but what can I do? Yes, I know he'll make me work some extra time to make it up. But you know I haven't been feeling well lately, so I want to find out what's wrong with me. Okay, I'll see you as soon as I can. I think I'm going to be in a bit late today. Could you let him know? N no, I can't rearrange it. Look, it's a firm appointment. No, I know he gets annoyed if anyone's late, but what can I do? Yes, I know he'll make me work some extra time to make it up. But you know I haven't been feeling well lately, so I want to find out what's wrong with me. Okay, I'll see you as soon as I can. You hear part of a radio news report. Where is the reporter? A, in a conference hall. B. Outside a building. C. In a hotel. And so it's over to our reporter David Muir, who's on the spot. Yes, thank you, Sue. We're expecting developments any minute now. For the past few days, I've been staying not far from here, and people have been gathering on the streets. It looks as if there might be trouble if they're not satisfied with the results of the talks. The leaders should be coming out very soon, and the moment they come down the steps, I'll try to fight my way through the crowd of other reporters on the pavement and get comments from them. Okay, David. We'll be back to you as soon as anything happens. And so it's over to our reporter David Muir, who's on the spot.
Yes, thank you, Sue. We're expecting developments any minute now. For the past few days, I've been staying not far from here, and people have been gathering on the streets. It looks as if there might be trouble if they're not satisfied with the results of the talks. The leaders should be coming out very soon, and the moment they come down the steps, I'll try to fight my way through the crowd of other reporters on the pavement and get comments from them. Okay, David. We'll be back to you as soon as anything happens. You hear someone on the radio describing her career. How does she feel? A. Content. B. Frustrated. C. Jealous. Yes, I've had a very varied career. I've had my successes and my failures, and that's the way life goes. All I can say is, I've never known what's going to happen next. I know that many other actors have had more success than me without my talent, and I could let that bother me, but that's not the way I am. I think that I might not have done everything I'm capable of, but worse things can happen to you. Yes, I've had a very varied career. I've had my successes and my failures, and that's the way life goes. All I can say is, I've never known what's going to happen next. I know that many other actors have had more success than me without my talent, and I could let that bother me, but that's not the way I am. I think that I might not have done everything I'm capable of, but worse things can happen to you. You hear part of a radio report. Who is speaking? A. A policeman. B. A motoring expert. C. A car driver. So many people just don't seem to understand what a weapon a vehicle is. Every holiday time we have the same thing. Every holiday time we give the same warnings, but every holiday time they take no notice. So many drivers are just so careless and, frankly, stupid. They obviously don't care about driving properly, or they wouldn't behave like they do. Then they wonder why they get involved in accidents, and when they do, we have to deal with the results. So many people just don't seem to understand what a weapon a vehicle is. Every holiday time we have the same thing. Every holiday time we give the same warnings, but every holiday time they take no notice. So many drivers are just so careless and, frankly, stupid. They obviously don't care about driving properly, or they wouldn't behave like they do. Then they wonder why they get involved in accidents, and when they do, we have to deal with the results. You hear someone talking on the telephone. What is he doing? A. Giving advice. B. Expressing disapproval. C. Trying to persuade. Look, I'm not going to go through this again. It's obvious that you never listen to a word I say. So what's the point in discussing it now? You shouldn't have bought that car. I told you enough times there are plenty of better ones for the money, but now that you have, it's too late to do anything about it. 
You asked me what I thought, and then you took no notice. Look, I can only tell you what I think. If you choose to ignore me, that's up to you. Look, I'm not going to go through this again. It's obvious that you never listen to a word I say. So what's the point in discussing it now? You shouldn't have bought that car. I told you enough times there are plenty of better ones for the money. But now that you have, it's too late to do anything about it. You asked me what I thought, and then you took no notice. Look, I can only tell you what I think. If you choose to ignore me, that's up to you. You hear two people discussing the local bus service. What's their opinion of it? A. The service is unreliable. B. The fares are too high. C. The journeys are very slow. What I object to is that the things never come when they're supposed to. Yeah. I mean, the other day, I must have been waiting for three quarters of an hour. They always seem to take ages to come, don't they? That's if they even turn up at all. I mean, they make this big thing about how you save money if you use them instead of going by car. And I suppose that's true, but... Yeah. Whether it's cheap or not is neither here nor there. If you can never be sure whether they're going to turn up or not. Quite. I don't know why they even bother to print the timetables. What I object to is that the things never come when they're supposed to. Yeah. I mean, the other day, I must have been waiting for three quarters of an hour. They always seem to take ages to come, don't they? That's if they even turn up at all. I mean, they make this big thing about how you save money if you use them instead of going by car. And I suppose that's true, but... Yeah. Whether it's cheap or not is neither here nor there. If you can never be sure whether they're going to turn up or not... Quite. I don't know why they even bother to print the timetables. You hear part of an interview with a sportsman. What is the situation? A. He has just won a match. B. He is about to play. C. He has decided to retire. Well, when I became the champion... I thought there was nothing else left for me to achieve. But after a while, when I got used to it, I wanted to win again and again. I'd really like to be out there today because I still think I can beat almost anyone. But, well, I've had my great victories, and you can't ask for more than that. I realize it's time to call it a day, and <laughs> after all, I can still play for fun. Well, when I became the champion, I thought there was nothing else left for me to achieve. But after a while, when I got used to it, I wanted to win again and again. I'd really like to be out there today, because I still think I can beat almost anyone. But, well, I've had my great victories, and you can't ask for more than that. I realize it's time to call it a day, and <laughs> after all... I can still play for fun.